Hello, hello everybody, Ori here with another video. Today we're going to be playing Panorama, which just came out today on Steam. It, it looks like a fun game. As with most games on this channel, I haven't played before. I've seen some trailers, haven't touched this game, don't know what it's like. You're going to be getting my first initial blind impressions, first, first impressions as you would call it. Let's read about what this game's about real quick. So Panorama, you're going to relax and unleash your creativity in this new city building puzzle game. Create amazing landscapes and discover your wide range of structures with special abilities. Enter the world of beauty and tranquility with the panoramas of your own creation. And don't forget to pet your an your new animal friends. Cool. This game, it looks like it's no, this isn't early access. This is going to be a full release. Yeah, this this looks like it's a full release. Cool. And this comes out. This comes out today. So there is a demo available. You can check it out if you would like to. But let's jump right into it and see what this game's see what this game's about. I'm already digging the intro screen. I this music is like just listen to this music for a second. I'm really feeling I'm really feeling this intro music. OK, graphics. There's not a ton of options here. Um, looks like we're probably going to be playing in. I don't know if you can play this with controller or not. I, I don't think so. It doesn't look like it. So we'll just we'll just play with mouse. OK, um, should we do the tutorial? I feel like we should do the tutorial. A game like this might be might be a little overwhelming to just jump in. OK, so we can move in and out. WASD hold right mouse button. Oh, look at the birds. OK, so we can rotate. And then E and Q do it to use wheel to zoom in. Or C and X place the tile with left mouse button. Each tile is its own type and levels up only its type. Meadows level all tiles up, huh? OK, so do we get to pick our tile? You can press the undo button in the right corner to undo your last move. OK, place a tile. OK, sometimes you will get a multi tile, which has multiple types. It can. Oh, OK, so it's kind of this is where I think the puzzle comes in is we can only we're only going to be able to play whatever the next piece is, right? Placing tiles gives you points. Once you reach a threshold, you'll get a booster pack. Those give you structures to build and a certain amount of tiles. OK, other times you might get a quest. You can place it anywhere you want. The number hovering over a tile means you have to upgrade it as many times to get a point reward. You can rotate the quest using the mouse wheel. Um, OK. OK, place the tile. OK, you received a booster pack. Click the booster pack icon to choose your reward. OK, fine. OK, so there's in this window, you can choose three random packs. Once you choose one, you're going to receive a structure blueprint, which you'll have to fill up with specified tile types. OK, so we I think we have to pick this one that <laughs> the arrow is pointing to. But there's windmill. So randomly places field tiles in a small range adds a small amount of tiles to queue every big amount of Adds a small amount of tiles to queue every big amount of field tiles placed. So that's the silo. And then we have a small forester lodge randomly places forest tiles in a small range. OK, so. Oh, man, How does this work? Like that. On the blueprint. Oh, cool. So, yeah, we, so we filled it out. Great. Now you know all the basics of the game. Finish the tutorial by reaching 75 points total using the knowledge you received. Keep in mind, losing all the tiles means game over. OK, so we're getting so I'm not sure. So this is the tile that we have next right down here. So if we connect it to certain things, we get more points. Oh, no, this is this is our tile. So now we have a forest tile, right? Is that a I, I, I'm not sure what our next tile is. All of these are one pointers, though. 
Okay, so this is this is our tile. It's the rock ones. Um, I'm not. Yeah, I guess maybe if you connect it to other rock types, it generates more points. The point system kind of confuses me a little bit right now. So we get we clearly get more points if we place them like by other forests. See, so if we put the forest by the other forest, we get more points. So that's three, four. But then if we put it here, we'll get six. OK, so these are water ones, so. I don't know if we can do anything with that. Um, OK, this we can just build here. The middle ones. See, so it kind of lights up what it's getting points for, I guess. The forest we'll put over here. Yep. This we'll put like over here. Okay, we're almost there. Forest can go somewhere over here, right here. Congratulations, you've proven your skills and are now ready to play the game and opt and optimize your moves. Okay, cool. I actually man, when I looked at this game, I thought this was actually gonna be more of a crafting survival type city builder game. I, I, I guess maybe I thought it was going to be more of a city builder game. I didn't realize it was going to be kind of like a puzzle game. That's fine. Current session will be lost. Are you sure? Um, no, don't we want to do new game? New game. OK. So it doesn't matter where we build this. We're still going to get one point meadow. So it's basically you're kind of just this is definitely going to be, I think, a chill kind of game. It I don't know how hard this is going to be, especially since it, <laughs> it tells you where the scores are, but you can kind of plan ahead by looking to see how you're going to build these. OK, so now we have a house. So we'll build our houses out this way. Our forest will build out this way. See, so we'll build our city over here. Oh, look, that even upgraded. So did that upgrade the tile? Maybe that's what that means. OK, we'll build our rock out here. Quest. <clears throat> OK, so let's see. Does this mean we need to have four forests near it? Is that what that was implying again? I'm not really I don't really remember what that that implies. Let's see. No, this is a different type of tile. I don't think that's a forest tile. OK, so that upgrades those again. See that so that upgrades those, I think. I forget what these type of tiles were again. OK, the water. Water will put. Yeah, let's put water around the thing. OK, so this is another quest one. So this is a house. Looks like a house quest. So, yeah, so OK, so you see the number of houses three. So if we put it here. It lowers it down to two. So we'll do the meadow, we'll do the forest here. Yeah, see, this wasn't the forest. I don't know what this is. I'm not sure what this tile is. OK, so I think we might have messed up this quest. See, OK, see, so that quest goes down. So we're kind of doing that part right. I, we messed up this one because I'm not sure what that tile was. Oh, wait, this looks like we're going to complete the quest, though. Yeah, see, we completed that quest, huh? I don't know what that means. I'll be honest. I'm, I'm not sure what that means. We'll put that there. OK, so we have another quest. So let's see. This is kind of the same one where I'm not quite sure what that tile means, but putting it here seems to generate a lot of points. OK, so another forest, put the forest back over here. Okay, water, we'll put water. We'll kind of, yeah, see, so you kind of want to build out. We'll put like their lake there. So this will complete the house quest. Yes, okay. Uh, more houses, more rocks. Water. Houses. More houses. We're going to build our houses out this way. 
OK, so we have OK, so we do have a limited amount of tiles. We have 66 tiles left. Um, I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to complete this quest. Let's see. So this is a water one. So we need to have four water tiles near it. <clears throat> OK, so that that gives us two. So, oh, let's see. Here's this one. OK, so this will. Yeah, this will lower it to one. Perfect. Now I, I get this quest complete it. OK, so this should be quest completed, too. So that gives us 20 points. Cool. <clears throat> structures built zero out of 16. How do we build structures then? Build the rocks out. OK, so I wonder how how do we do this? Oh, no, <laughs> I haven't. I wasn't clicking on these. Levels up all oh, that. Oh, man. Expands the zone of control. Upgrades mountain tiles. Oh, man. I wish we weren't doing that. Ooh, what does this do? I forget what this does. So are we going to build a bunch of stuff? Is, is that what this is doing? Let's see. Oh, nope. Wrong. I messed that. I think I might have messed that up. <laughs> uh, local hall. OK, so I think this just means maybe this means we need those tiles there to build that. Is that what that means? I kind of forgot what that quest marker meant. OK, another quest. Three houses. OK, so this yeah, this does get a little complicated. So we're going to need two of those because you don't want to box yourself in, you know, but you still want to. Let's put this over kind of on this side, I guess. We'll put that right there. OK, so houses. OK, so. Oh, yes, this is so cool. OK, so we need to build the meadows and then another house to complete that area. OK, where do we want to build that over there? OK, so. Oh, but I can't build that house there because I need the connecting tiles. OK, so now I can build that there. Oh, something happened. Oh, no, this is OK. <laughs> I got confused. This is the this is the quest tile. OK, so we need two houses. So. Right there seems fine. We'll build that right there. Um, What do these ones mean, though? Oh, no, did I just ruin that? Undo. Yeah, I think I ruined that when I did that. Oh, OK, so this looks oh, this is the half and half. That's what that means. And then this is all three. OK, I see now I see. Very nice game. And then we'll build a house there, build our forest over here. Rocks held over here. Water can still go over here. This is a half and half. OK, I can't build that there, though, because it gives me the red icon. So I'm assuming that doesn't count. The, the house doesn't. Oh, no, this isn't. That's because it's not necessarily a meadow. OK, house. House will build right here and complete that quest. We need to let's try to expand out to this, too. Man, I really need this metal one. I keep getting <laughs> we keep getting houses. OK, another quest. Forest will do. Yeah, forest will do right there. Forest wheat field again. When am I going to get this? It looks like I'm not going to get this till right here. Oh, we have another we have another thing, a small orchid adds a small. Which one looks the coolest? Let's do let's do the orchid. We can do the orchid, man, this game is gorgeous. I hope you I hope you all like appreciate how gorgeous this game is. OK, so this is our wheat field again or our desert. No, this looks like wheat. This is wheat field. Um, we'll build this kind of going out, I guess. So, OK, so now we can build our rocks, our forest. This is a half and half. Another quest uh, mountains. Where do we have mountains? Um, a lot of mountains at over here. So this one might be a little tricky. But we can do this right here. OK, another house. OK, so there we 
Yeah. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. Oh, this is so gorgeous. What an amazing, lovely game. What an amazing, lovely game this is. Okay, rock right here. Oh, I'm so excited to see what everything is. Forest. Let's build over there to complete that quest or near completion house. Um, right here. Okay, another quest. All rocks, though. Let's build this. So we need to it looks like we need to connect it to the piece that it's asking us to. So that can go right there. That's going to. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Look at this. Gorgeous. I love this. What a nice, chill game this is. Uh, let's do the barn. We'll put the barn. <laughs> um, we have 61 tiles still. Structures built. Do I need to build the structures to complete the quest? I'm not sure what how we win this game. OK, so we'll put that right there. OK, so water. Because this keeps going up. The score keeps going up every time. I'm not sure what like the end game is here on this particular level. Do we just keep going until all the tiles are out? Okay, this doesn't connect to anything, though. Can I put that there? Oh, I guess I can. I can. Oh, I can put the tiles anywhere I want. I thought they had to connect. I guess they don't. Um, finish that quest. Okay, wheat. Do I need wheat anywhere else? Right there. Right there. Forests right there. Okay, this is a mix. Um, <clears throat> that can go over there. Forest again can go there. Houses. We'll keep our houses over here. House. Okay, that can go there. That finishes that area. Okay, now we have another quest. Um, let's see. We'll build over here. Yeah, because we'll just keep the rocks together. Keep them close for that quest. Houses. I want to kind of build up this area more. Okay, so I need rocks over here still. It does a good job of displaying what what's needed too. So these are our quests. So we need rocks and then these are our structures. So it does a pretty good job of separating, separating what they are. OK, so now we have I forget which structure that was. OK, we now we can do another one. Uh, geyser. Yeah, we're going to do the geyser. And it expands so you kind of can choose what you want to do. So if you want to expand a lot, you can expand a lot. But then you really need to build kind of far out there. Well, let's just try that. Let's just see. Oh, yeah. See, no, I, I can't build out there. So you do have to. You do kind of have to. You can only build on these spots, but they don't have to connect to anything. I get it now. So we'll I guess we'll kind of build going out there. Because I need I really just need rock. That's all I need right now. OK, rock. Complete that quest houses. We're just going to build out. I don't I want to see what this this thing is like water. Yeah, see, I can't put the water there. Uh, water rock will come over here to start finishing this one. Um, huh. That lights up red, so I wonder why that lights up red. Maybe because it means, oh, so if I build, oh, we kind of pigeon, yeah, we kind of pigeonholed ourselves. Then we can't, we can't complete this quest. That's why, because I need, I need two rock structures to connect to this piece, and I can't. So we're gonna have, yeah, we're gonna have to fail that quest. I get it now. I get it. Okay, put water. Um, again, we're just gonna be building out here, so we can try this area. Okay, forests. Put back over here. OK, we have another quest houses. So you you definitely need to think about where you want to build these. See, so if I put it there, that completes this part of the quest. But now it still leaves me open for more. Love it. OK, that's complete. OK, 
Okay, that counts as rock. So now we just need water. Okay, we'll build our house over here. Oh, we got another one. Sapling of Honesty Fountain. Let's do this one. We'll put this one. Um, we'll just put this one kind of right. Yeah, like right there. All right, that can go right there. Another quest. OK, so now we have a water. Oh, man, we might have to build this one a little further out. Water and wheat. Oh, no, I forgot. I wanted to do waters for those. I got so excited. <laughs> Uh, okay, so wheat, wheat, water, this counts as water, cool. Okay, so, so now we have our geyser. Okay, now we, we're going to do our forest over here. This only needs one more wheat, that's complete. Okay, this can go, I don't think we have, oh, we have the forest over here that we need to do still. Forest and water. Let's just build that there. This counts as a forest, right? Water. That completes that quest. Rock. Forest. Another water quest. Let's put this over here. Put that right there. Forest. Look at this. Look how gorgeous this game looks. This is this is the ultimate just chill, chill game. Look at this, 18 points. Let's complete that. Uh, this counts as water. OK, so now we need wheat and forest, so we'll just kind of build around. Oh, another quest. Um, OK, we'll put that right there. We got another thing. Um, local cafe. Local cafe is going to go over here. Okay, so that we can build there. Forest. Do I need forest? I do. Forest over here. Houses. We need the houses over there. Okay, this is rock water, so that counts as water. We'll do the water right there. This counts as water. But I also need wheat, too. What do I need over here? Houses? Okay, let's finish up the water one rock we'll continue with our rocks okay this counts as a house no oh that's that counts as wheat wheat not house okay that's the house house again okay we're gonna finish our cafe now oh uh, i wish i could i wish i could have rotated it Oh, huh, OK, if it's so I guess if you want it to be aesthetically pleasing, you're going to have to rotate. You're going to have to see. I wonder if you can see how the structure looks beforehand, because that does kind of mess up how I wanted it. I want it, you know, I wanted it to face all the houses. OK, so now we have more wheat. Did our music run out? Oh, no, there it goes. And then we got more water, more rock. More water again, we'll put our. We'll kind of build out this way a little bit. OK, we're going to put this right here. Houses. Just keep those over there. Forests. Finish that quest. OK, we, have, we only have six tiles left. So we're not going to be able to do too much more here. OK. So I wonder why this counts. Oh, the metal counts as everything. That's that's why, right? Because I think we read that because you can see like right here, it has all the colors. So I think that counts as everything for quests. I get it. OK, we'll build this house over here. Then we have we. Oh, perfect. Let's finish up. This quest and then we get a new quest, but we're not going to be able to complete it. The end. Game over, go back to menu. Oh, did we lose? 
<laughs> I think we lost. I think we're. I think the quest was to build the structures. I think was that. Was that what the actual quest was? We weren't. I wasn't really paying attention to these enough, but we also didn't really get a lot. Game over. Go back to menu. I'm, yeah, I'm not sure exactly what the. I guess I'm not sure what the actual structure was. I thought we were trying to just complete this score down here. I'm not sure, but man, this game was. This game was was gorgeous. What a what a good puzzle game this was. I love the aesthetics and I do. I do like the puzzle elements of it. I didn't think there was going to be any strategy to this game, but I think there I mean, there clearly is. You have to because we lost a quest in this rock area because I kind of pigeonholed myself into I couldn't build in a certain area. So there's there's a middle ground you have to make between making your little panorama look aesthetically pleasing and also practical for your quest. So you always need to leave open areas. See, so like two houses that only gives us these two spaces. And so then I wonder if we couldn't complete this three trees too, you know? So we I don't think we would have been able to finish these quests because we didn't put these in a structurally right place. But man, what if what a good game this game releases today? I would 100 percent check this game out. There is a demo on Steam. I'm not sure what the price is, though. There's no there's no price right now listed on this game. You can add it to your wish list and see see what it's about. But thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I loved this game. I think this game is absolutely charming. I need to figure out exactly how the level works, though. Right, let's go back to the let's go back to the main menu. Save and main menu. I'm not exactly sure how the levels in this game will work because I think I lost. <laughs> I think I lost that level because I didn't build enough structures. So we'll have to figure out exactly what what the objective is to win this game. If there even really is a win, I, I'm assuming there's a win. Maybe you get different levels, harder areas, harder puzzles, harder structures to build, things like that. I don't know. But again, this is just a preview video. I just wanted to showcase this game for a little bit. So I really hope you enjoyed this. If you liked this video, please click the like button and subscribe to the channel. And if you like the video, feel free to comment. If you hated the video or hate this game, feel free to comment. Also, any sort of engagement on these videos really helps me. And I really appreciate anything. If you have things you want to see done better or if you just like this game and you want to comment on how much you love it, feel free to do anything. Thank you so much for watching and I'll check you out for my next video. Have a great day, everybody.